if you want to save time on grinding your badges and overall, make sure you hit up Hero Grinders on Instagram or Twitter for the fastest and safest way to get your badges maxed out. Links will be in the description. What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel for this quick one. And today we'll be talking about the relation of your stamina rating to your stamina bar. This one came from a comment request, so please let me know in the comment section and your recommendation for a topic. I'll see what I can do. And just want to invite you guys as well to check my new channel out. I'll be covering real life NBA stuff in there. It's going to be cool. So it would be really awesome if you guys can support me with that channel. So now, let's get right into the video. So first, I don't know how 2K calls it, but let's call this one current stamina and this one overall stamina. So we'll be using those terms in these tests. So first one, we'll be testing if stamina rating affects the capacity of current stamina. So in here, we got 50 and 99 stamina and I can't even see a difference. I might be wrong with this one, like it's really hard to really see if they're exactly the same, but it's either a no or the difference is super super small, to the extent that we don't need to consider it knowing it's a 50 to 99 gap already. Now let's try it on dribbling, and same thing here, I can't see much of a difference. I know there's like a millisecond difference between them, but it could be just a margin of error. It is super small, even in my handles for day stats before, every upgrade is one dribble animation away, which makes more sense. So I believe the stamina rating doesn't touch it, it's going to be handles for day's badge only. So now you might be wondering, what is the use of stamina then? That's for our last test, we'll be testing how many reps can a 50 and 99 rating do before that Gatorade icon to appear. And now, I see a lot of difference. On 50, I got 106 reps, and for 99, we got 125 reps. Don't focus on the actual numbers, focus on the actual gap. We just want to know if stamina affects it. So in summary, stamina rating only affects the overall stamina, it doesn't really touch the stamina bar here, no matter if it's dribbling or just running around. So that's all for the video. If you guys like it, please smash that like button and please consider subscribing for more videos. And don't forget to drop by the channel for lots of other contents. And as always, stay safe and happy gaming, guys. Peace.